So welcome again to Life with Jennifer. Now, love all that on a ball. Me just collect my package, let me show you now. See it here? Somebody send me my little Mother's Day gift. And they send me two weeks for my Mother's Day. Because some people are criticizing me. Have. But me you have to bring this to you now. You have to tell me. And when you tell me, this is one of the wigs we're coming on the pack. So you see before I go ever put it on and go around, I put it on. And then you have to tell me if you think I for wearing a wig here for go up on the road. It depends on what you have to tell me. So I wonder if I put it right. Hold on. I think I need to come over some more. So you know, go. Uh, you know, I judge now, you know. You know, I judge and you know, go. You know, go tell me because I know I no wig here. It can cause a lot of critics. And show me now it can cause a lot of critics. <laughs> Just go collect it from the mail. And me say, me go. <laughs> you say before me, go do nothing too much with no wig here. Me I go go up online. Do this video and make them people tell me what they think about the wig. So all the thing. Me na, me na know if me. Me no, me not I. Me leave it for enough to come in at it, right? And tell me what I think about the wig. Let me see the next one. Me not showing the next one yet. When time comes for me put it on. Let me tell you, I say when you bless, you bless enough. When you bless, you bless. And who oh God bless, no man can curse. Me never wear a color wig yet. This would have been my first time I wear a color wig. But you have to tell me about nothing. But anyway, I don't have the wig I come here to talk to you about. But you have to leave a comment and let me know what you really think about it. My problem is, I see, I see Christopher Tufton put out, put out a statement. Put out a statement my people in regards to critic account to him people who are criticizing him people who are criticizing him all on then people are criticizing him in straw hardship are hypocrites and I am saying to you, sir, how could you come out with such a thing to say? People are criticizing you, are hypocrites, sir. Hold on. Under your leadership as Minister of Wealth, as well as a wealth and health, wealth, wellness and health, how it goes, somewhere like that. How, tell me. Tell me how you want to explain it to us because. Something must have really wrong my people. I wonder if I really see the clips them and the video them will go out showing people and lay them a hospital bed and, and a bed. I wonder if I see like a young lady will come out the other day with a door. Some, some chemotherapy because she has cancer in her leg. And she got to Cornwall Regional Hospital. Anna. They tell her that if she have to carry a bed, because a bed is not at the hospital, and in order for her to get treatment, she would have to carry a bed. People are asked to carry bed to hospital under your leadership, sir. What hospital don't have? Conwell region and a bill for all long and every year we hear say additional money going on for it. Are you coming for can talk about critics? Huh? You're coming for can talk about critics? Tell me something that you implement in the health sector since you take office of Minister of Health. Something that is an initiative that will go down in the history book to say you were the one who implemented because men don't know. Maybe, maybe it's there, but men don't know. So, I am asking you. When people go to a government hospital and they don't have an x-ray machine and have to be sent to some private lab, some not even have the money. What are you saying? Come on, medication like blood pressure tablet. 
the hospital can fill a prescription with a blood pressure tablet. They can fill a prescription with metformin for diabetes. The poor little people may go and yes, they, they have to wait for overnight till night, catch them again to see the doctor. Even when they see the doctor, the common prescription cannot be filled at the government hospital. Now they can get an x ray done. And you have the audacity. You have the audacity to come out and talk about people are criticizing you. Tell me what you want the people to say about you. Since nobody enough to criticize you, tell me. And when you tell me, I will follow it. While I can prove it, because something I miss somebody here. Mr. Mr. Tufton, your constituency is just a stone throw from the Spanish Town Hospital. Go there and go in the, uh, the emergency part. I don't know how those nurses work under those conditions. It has a bad smell. Yeah? You, you, you seem like you don't know what's going on, my brother. You seem like you lost. So you come out now and make big plan. I'm going to know what they promise you. But you yeah, talk about the leadership of the Jamaica Labour Party. So Tufton is saying that under the JLP Health Minister, Dr. Christopher Tufton said, the Jamaica Labour Party is the best option for Jamaica who want to see continued improvement in the health care sector. Dr. Tufton has acknowledged that the government has work to do to improve its relationship with the Jamaican people. But the record is there and is asking people to continue with the leadership of the Jamaica Labour Party. Dr. Tufton also said there is no truth to claims that the government spent $21 million on the renovation project at the Cornwall Regional Hospital in St. James. During his contribution to the sectoral debate on Tuesday, Dr. Tufton told the House that the sum including the expenditure and multiple other health facility in Western Jamaica, the health minister said the allegation of cost overrun and the projects are false. Me wonder if them people are living a real right now. Me, me, not, me not know how I don't know how oh, oh, to say Alright, since I'm going to tell life on you then Come out and tell everybody What is the real truth What is the real truth Because I don't know And I am of the view That the people who are using the system Are complaining And if the people who are using the system Are complaining Brother, I don't know one person said a brother a good boy never him say one thing pan, and it come true just all over the country telling people to go take the vaccine and now look at what estrogen is saying about it you need to address the people dying left right and center from this thing and people are dead enough you see people are dead and them say so wanna invest themselves into funeral homes you know, there's a lot to think about. The same man will come out and talk and open him mouth and want we to believe him that him is all this perfect. So it look like I must see him, them are going to get the leadership of the party because I notice that him will come out more and more and attack. And I notice a lesser, a, 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 a Mr. Brogan. So it look like a him, them are going to get the party. So him take time and come out now and tell Jamaica people about Then him put about him have evidence and the impact of the budget. 2016 to 17, 60 billion, and then I'm gonna have 146 billion for spend for 24, 25. The one no. Oh, no. Listen, my people, me never gonna further into this a conversation. Eh? Oh, no, tell me what I think about Dr. Christopher Tufton. I want him come out and I say now, all of a sudden, 
when I make we know. When the conversation continue, because I don't know where he come from now. Because he take time. I notice what's going on in the people. He take time to push him head out now. You know. I take time to push him head out. Anyway, the conversation continue. Remember, I know. When you tell me what I think about this week, whatever I want to say is exactly what I'm going to do. And you know, say, me love you know. And I'm your girl, Auntie Jen, so no make me know if me look young or fresh, if the color right, or if the color not right. Me figure say if the color not right, me go buy it, me go dye it in a black. Tell me what you think. Like, share, and subscribe. I'll catch you later.